what's the future for Juliet? Would the silo ever remain the same again? How many more secrets are waiting to be discovered? Silo 2 is set to change everything with more answers than questions, and it's gonna be insane. After being forced to go out, Juliet finally did the impossible and went farther than the tree. And for the first time in the history of the silo, things are about to take a very different and dangerous turn. After the latest sheriff, Juliet made it out. We saw that the world is likely the same for everyone, as there are signs of many other silos, like the one she just came from. And the show is about to get scary, as viewers would see how Juliet survives outside and see if she can get into any of the other silos. You should know that Juliet may have successfully passed the tree where Holston Becker and his wife Allison couldn't pass through, but many crises are still ahead. The unknown world holds a lot to be discovered by Juliet's curious mind, but it will only get more dangerous as she steps further into it. If the lies looked cruel and terrible, the truth now looks twice as bad. Since Silo is based on the book series written by Hugh Howey, the book readers shouldn't expect to find many clues about season two from the books. And this is because the showrunners already mixed the story up by not precisely following what's in the books. In one of the novels, Juliet meets a man named Solo and gets into Silo 17 next to Silo 18 where she came out from. Whether the show follows this exact story or not, Juliet would want to seek help from the other silos, especially with how the suit she had on only has a limited supply of oxygen, and the only way that Juliet can survive this is to visit the nearest silo. Also, many threatening things could be waiting outside, and Juliet can't stay longer without finding a safe space. So in season two, after seeing a temporary safe place, she could figure out how to communicate with the family and friends she left behind in silo 18 and even work her way through till she returns with more information that could help those she left behind. Now there are many ways Juliet's risky adventure could turn out as there might be nobody alive both outside and in the silos around, making Juliet's survival outside even more challenging. If lucky, she could find people in any of the nearest silo, and her problem would be getting them to accept her. If the other silo members have been curious too and need a way out or someone from the world to inform them, they might gladly accept Juliet into their midst and through this, Juliet would make new friends that could help her find a way to reach out to her former silo. However, you should know that Juliet will achieve much more, being the first person to get out of the enclosed space. As Bernand, the mayor mentioned, Juliet's cleaning saw the highest number of turnouts and viewers in the history of the silo, which means everyone is very interested in her fate. And also, for the very first time, they all see Juliet walk past the tree without falling and becoming unalive, which gives them a glimpse of hope that the world outside isn't as terrible as they were made to believe. While hoping might be a good thing, it's hazardous for the silo because new rebels are about to be formed and all isn't done yet because more wars and troubles are just about to start and the crazy thing is that Walker might be at the forefront of the new rebel group, which will turn things upside down or in the right way. Juliet challenged everyone and kept the judicial, the unseen management, and even Walker on her toes. At the finale of Silo, we saw Walker take a long walk from deep down to up top just to be able to support Juliet, as she couldn't continue to restrict herself to the room now that her beloved Juliet was going out to clean. Walker knew Juliet would meet the same fate as Holston and Allison if she didn't help. If you still don't understand the season's ending, Walker is the reason why Juliet is still alive by asking Carla for help to use the heat tape from Mechanical to make Juliet's cleaning suit. So seeing as her plans worked, Walker wouldn't stop helping Juliet from within the silo, as Juliet's exit could form a rebellious group led by Walker herself. Also, Shirley and Knox from Mechanical genuinely feel bad for what happened to Juliet, and Knox would always blame himself, which is why they will both be a big part of season two. And of course, Knox and Shirley would work with Walker and might look for ways to mobilize the people against the mayor and Sims. Remember that the story is where it is because the mayor and Sims lied that Juliet wanted to go out even though she never asked to. And with what had happened before Juliet went out and what happened after she did, the people will start asking for answers they would only get from the rebels. Soon enough, they will all find out that the mayor and Sims have been doing more than lying by trying to get rid of Juliet. So expect a bigger war and protest 
to follow Juliet's exit, which would be fatal. Nothing will ever remain the same again in the silo as more people could ask to go out. With all the troubles expected in Silo 2, the silo will become more and more difficult to guard and oversee because the people will now stop being manageable, and that leaves more work for the mayor and Sims. Starting from where it all stopped, the mayor has a big task ahead of him as there needs to be a story to sell to the people. A thing started going wrong from the IT department when they all saw the green leaves, tree, and birds from the video that Juliet was transmitting, and the mayor asked them all to look away before he shut it down. But since Sims desperately wants to be the mayor's shadow as the mayor already dangled the offer in front of him again, Sims would like to do anything to impress the mayor, no matter the questions he has in his own heart. Also, when Mayor hurriedly left the cafeteria to the server room to change the display that Juliet discovered was fake, he might also have alerted the other silo leaders that Juliet survived her cleaning. And he could still sell more lies to the people on reasons why Juliet could make it that far to delay or stop a rebellion from starting. But in Silo 2, the mayor would still have the upper hand since he knows many things that the others don't, and he also has all the weapons and technology needed to conquer any battle that might be raised by Walker and people in the Mechanical. The crazy thing, however, is that it will still be a brutal war because Mechanical also has extensive control of how things work in the silo. The most significant part is the generator that provides the electricity they can turn off. So a bigger war is happening in Silo 2 and Juliet could return to change it all and overtake the mayor and Sims. There's a door underneath the silo that George discovered, but Juliet couldn't get to it due to her fear of water. So Juliet might return to explore this door as it could lead to more answers on what happened and what's happening. So that big door could open in season two, but for that to happen, Juliet has to return to Silo 18 because she's the only one alive who knows the door exists, aside from the mayor who runs the silo. One crazy thing about Juliet is that aside from the people from Mechanical, she has other people who love and silently root for her. And Lucas Kyle and Paul Billings are one of those people and also a significant part of the future of what happens next at the silo. Billings grew up smart by learning the pact and how the system works. And he's also possibly the next sheriff. And you can tell there's something about this position already because it won't be long before Billings starts asking questions too, especially after seeing the book hidden in Juliet's apartment. From looking at the stars to learning how they shift, Kyle is also knowledgeable, but these two men have two things in common. Fear of the unknown and what might happen to their family if caught at something that goes against the rules and order. Kyle being sent to the mines might be a blessing in disguise as he could discover the big door that George told Juliet about. Billings will also get to see more secrets on his sheriff's duty, and these two are about to blow up Silo 2 with their rebellions and a possible alliance with Walker. With Silo 2 promising to change everything that Silo stands for, the casting would still be the same as most of the cast, and supporting casts will return. The main lead, Juliet, who Rebecca Ferguson plays, is reprising her role, as there's still so much to see this character do. The exciting thing about Silo is that the show isn't going to keep the fans waiting at all, as filming for season two has already started, according to Rebecca Ferguson, and even though the release date isn't official yet, fans of this fascinating show could expect to see Silo 2 in 2024. What do you think of the crazy and captivating things that could happen in Silo 2? Share your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching.